All right, Brad, to the kitchen we go, or we hope it's clean. <laughs> it is clean in here. Good morning to you guys. Fall starts this week, as we all know, on Thursday. And that comes with a whole new batch of local ingredients to cook with. Joining me this morning with different foods to eat for this fall is Humphrey's executive chef, Nicholas Borg. Good morning to you. How are you? I'm doing great. We're cooking with spaghetti squash this morning. And I'm looking at this. I, go, I looked at you in a minute ago, and I said, that looks fairly simple to make, <laughs> is it? Well, we were just talking about it, yeah. and actually, it truly is very simple. Um, this is the spaghetti squash, okay. amongst the other squash that we brought. But simply, simply said, just heat your oven up to 350, cut this in half, mm -hmm. and then scoop out the seeds. Put, I put actually honey or agave nectar, salt and pepper, some fresh thyme, and then just roast it for you know, 45 minutes to an hour. And then actually it'll come out, if you take a fork, Yeah. it'll just come out if you just fork it out. It'll come out just like spaghetti. Look at that. And uh, You know, we yeah. talked about the fall ingredients. Is there fall ingredients that you switch the menu up, that you add to the certain yeah. menu items? I mean, it's a little different in San Diego and uh -huh. California because we do have the bounty of the, of the weather here. But... Um, I'd like to say I brought tomatoes today because uh, beginning of fall is the end of summer, obviously. And in San Diego, we have great tomatoes, so I did bring those. Those yeah. are kind of the last of the season. They look um, delicious, my God. Yeah, they're, they're amazing. amazing. Yeah. So you put this in over here. Yeah, a little Is that something you add to this mix right here? Yeah, I was going to put that just kind of fresh topping on there. Okay. But w w during winter, we kind of we like to say slow things down. We, we do a lot more braising, slow cooking, uh, as mm -hmm. I mentioned, with the squash. And then just a little, a few different ingredients. I mean, obviously... California or not, we still have seasons here, so. Sort of. <laughs> yeah, sort of. <laughs> right? <laughs> so what we did is, uh, yeah, I poached some lobster. Okay. Um, the lobster comes from the East Coast. Wow. And then I got this, uh, I went to Specialty Produce and got the spaghetti squash. Okay. So super simple, and I actually use, like I said, agave nectar in here. The lobster, which is cooked. Well, I'm glad you mentioned that. Can people go to stores and actually get, will there be aisles labeled fall ingredients, or how would you find something to switch up maybe what you're doing at home? Well, the beauty of the, today is everybody's so educated. If you go to your produce guy at the store, they're mm -hmm. going to know what's fresh and what's not. A lot of them are super passionate in what they do. Yeah. Um, so in, in my case, specialty produce, I go over there and they have all their primary, and you'll notice this at grocery stores too, the stuff that's in season is going to be in your face. It's going to be featured, right? And sometimes the stuff they want to get rid of too, but <laughs> <laughs> the closeout stuff, yeah. But uh, usually you'll see it; it'll be it'll be pretty obvious. Yeah. Um, so wow, yeah, I just I super light. I mean, obviously the butter's not that light, but then we we make up for it in other ways. Um, and then I brought some sriracha salt just to sprinkle a little bit on yeah, the top just, of that. Just to finish it. Look at that! Look at how good you make that look. I mean, that's something you could whip together in what. Two hours at your house? Oh, yeah, usually <laughs> two hours. Piece of cake. Hey, you guys are switching up the menu a little bit at Humphreys. What are you doing? We are. Like I said, we'll slow it down. We'll start doing, I think we're going to put some bison short rib on there. Um, obviously, we'll look to the vendors, see what we have. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of slower cooked stuff, pork belly, uh, pork chops, that type of stuff. Some compotes made with fruit. Chef, do you have a favorite? And, Come on, what's your favorite for this time of year when we switch into fall and transition into winter? What do you like to cook the most? I mean, Is there I one thing? I love pot roast myself. Do you um, really? Yeah, I mean, that's kind of how I grew up. I grew up eating meat and potatoes, so. Yeah. Um, will I put pot roast on the menu? Probably not, but that short rib will definitely make up for it. <laughs> Sounds so good. Well, we appreciate you showing us this morning. I mean, sure. look at how delicious I love. Have you seen this at home? Look at this. Simple. Two hours at my house, and ten minutes <laughs> at his house, yeah. But it can be done. We appreciate you coming in. Thanks Nicholas so much. Moore, yeah, appreciate Executive it. Chef over at Humphreys. Hey, if you want more inf information, I should say, on him and what's going on at uh, Humphreys, you can always go to our website, fox5sanigo.com. You guys, real easy. Take your big old squash and stick it right on that <laughs> Xenon tab. Guys, we'll get it back to you. Chrissy, take it away.